Uh, I really just want to do one little thing while I'm still in my holiday mug. Uh, there is an achievement in the game called, I believe, Do You Want to Build a Snowman? I, I do not think that is a major animation studio copyright, copyright <laughs> title. But uh, I think they could take it with the... They can appreciate it. And it's, from what I understand, a very easy, a very easy achievement, and it's seasonal. I just kind of wanted to do it in my, you know, my, my Winter Vale gear. I'm assuming everyone's gotten their presents this year, and grandmother. Why can I never a great father, grand, whatever winter, uh, <laughs> great father winter, um, in Ogremar or Ironforge. Happy Winter Vale, everybody. Happy. Holidays, happy upcoming New Year. So, this particular achievement, let's see if I can find the name of it. I don't think there's, yeah. Do you want to build a snowman? Also, a frosty shake. During the Feast of Wintervale, use your Wintervale disguise. It, it's actually one of the kits that, uh, um, Grandfather Winter sends you, Great Father Winter sends you in the mail if you make him milk and cookies. I think it's like the second email he sent, email, the second letter he sent you. Uh, but yeah, so that's easy to do. Uh, but as far as your snowman quest, do you want to build a snowman is what we're going for. Build a snowman the extra span. And there's only one place to do this. Um, you can't build it anywhere in the extra span. There is a place where there are snowballs. You have to move those snowballs. And you have to build a snowman. And as you may notice from our little friend, uh, Kathy, over here, uh, it's giving you an idea of what you can do with these snowballs. We have a snowball over here. We also have two little guys over here. Look a little sad. But they do have a snowball. And we have to find three of them, and we have to roll them. And here's, here's actually another one. So... I know where three snowballs are. So we can get started with this. But where are we on the map? That's important. Uh, there is a Tuscar village. Azure Span. It's between Camp Nowhere and um, the Azure Vault. It's almost, almost in the middle. It's above this area. So it's like right nestled here. This little corner of this lake um, and you'll know you're in the right spot if you see this village and these folks fishing and you see this little guy rolling around a snowball pretty straightforward um, I don't think they offer any dialogue choices other than your standard click on them and hear them so yeah they don't sell anything they don't really have any oh well <clears throat> excuse me apparently he's got an achievement white whisker what is this so let me look what Niptuck has to say. <laughs> Mama says my tusks will be bigger than <laughs> mammoths. Do you know there are animals that can blend in with the snow? Mama told me to wear these glasses to protect my eyes when I'm outside. But I do it because... I... But I do it because... Help me, smart snowy... They missed a word here. <laughs> But I do it because it helps me spot the snowy friends better. Do you want to try? I would like some snow glare glasses. I'm going to do this after. I'm going to try the snowball first. Uh, okay, so, bye. So I'll, I'll come back. I'll come back to you, I swear. No, no, I'll come back to you. I, I need to roll some snowballs. So my understanding is... Oh, okay, they go a ways. If they go in the lake, they disappear. My understanding, this is easier than Animal Crossing, but you can do this in Animal Crossing right now. Um, where, like, Animal Crossing, you have to be extremely precise with the snowball sizes um, in terms of how they are with you. My understanding is you do not have to be quite as precise with these, thankfully. Uh, now... I'm gonna grab this other one. I'm gonna yeah. you roll really far. I know I'm decently geared right now, but 
that affects my snowballs. I don't think so. But how much seems to roll farther than this one? Then again, it is getting bigger. Maybe that's... No, they roll about the same distance. And unlike Animal Crossing, you don't lose snow when they roll on a road or dirt. So it's already easier. I'll roll this one around a bit. Now, supposedly all I have to do is get them to the right size and then it takes care of itself. So there's no getting it wrong. There's no... The head is too small. The head's the right size. You don't get any judgment from snowmen like you do in Animal Crossing. Look, I like that one. I can actually build the snowman. Usually I get one out of every three right. <laughs> I haven't, I haven't, I haven't played much Animal Crossing lately, but I do think about it. I play it once a month so that the roaches don't show up at my house. No. See now, in Animal Crossing, if it ran into a tree, it would cease to be. Thankfully, if it's on an incline, it doesn't roll into the water. Oh, that's good to know. Yeah, I just had the urge to do this this morning. What I'm doing... Uh, it was on my list of things to do. But... What I'm doing, aside from this, is I'm, I'm moving characters through uh, Dragonflight. I'm gearing them up. Uh, there's certain characters I want to move through. Like I wanted, to, I wanted to move my druid through uh, Mirdrasil for the new appearances. I have to check if my Kulchiran druid and if my Zendalari druid. Yes, I have one of each also. Uh, if their appearances can change because the Kulchiran. If you don't have one, um, has wicker animals it turns into, and I'm just curious to know if there's a wicker owl flying mount uh, uh, that you could turn into rather, uh, and because that would be cool, because that means else, but that also means I'd have to bring my the snowballs apparently could roll on top of each other. Um, just trying to get... I want to put the balls on a good spot, but it gets... I think that might be the biggest challenge of all of this. Alright, we're going to leave that ball there. I think that's as big as you can get them. So. So, I need to investigate that, because that might mean I'm putting two more druids through um, the Emerald Dream stuff. Because I, I want those appearances. And uh, uh, Zandalari are dinosaurs. So you get dinosaur forms, which is cool. So if you get, I don't know, some Emerald Dream dinosaur type thing? Or maybe just for those two, their forms are special enough to not uh, get new ones. I don't know. I find it a little... If someone's only druid is a Zandalari... Or Kulteran, that would kind of suck. But yeah, so... I'm going to just leave those there. <laughs> they don't say anything, you can't click on them. So I just have to wait for them to approve of my snowball size. From my understanding... Uh, a lot of uh, folks... I Like, I've looked this up a little bit just to see if I'd run into any snags. If there were any bugs or anything to be aware of ahead of time. Um, and the advice is pretty much, if you put them near the kids, the kids take care of it. Or the game takes care of it, and you assume the kids did. So, this is, you know... When I did the apple kicking in, um, Horrific Visions, uh, Stormwind, to get the, the spider toy. 
there were a hundred of those to click. Uh, that took longer, I think. I also edited that. I might have stood a little bit. No, no, don't go in the lake. No, no, not in the lake. All right, so. I'm not sure how big I have to get them. Oh wow, the snowman, yay! Well, that did it, okay. Um, and then the snowballs reappear. So, I mean, it, there's no corn cop pipe or button nose or two eyes made out of coal, but you know, he's frosty. <laughs> All right, let me, let me pose with the kids. All our hard work, our hard work, they, they just watched me do it. So, uh, Say that. Uh, Say that as a JPG because Twitch gives me. Twitch doesn't like the files with my dick. Right. So, I mean, I kind of wish it had a little bit more detail than this, but it'll do. So let's go see what this other thing is about. I may have to look that up because I'm not expecting there to be an additional thing to do over here. There's no snowball. Yeah, much easier than building snowmen and uh, Animal Crossing. <laughs> By far. It looks like the snowballs were in the same spot where I found them. So there's one over here by the hooks. There's another one as you're walk going towards the kids. There's another one over here on the right side of this little dirt road thing between the lake, uh, lake and the road. And then there's another one by the kids. Match with your snowballs. Supposedly there are others hidden. But, but yeah, and then we got the achieve. Not a big deal, but you know, it's a little fun to do winter morning during the holidays. Okay, so let's find out what our friend, our friend here has for us. I don't know how long I'm going to stream today. Just really doing this in the morning and capturing it and then posting something. There are already videos up about this. I'm not doing anything new. Um, but wanted it for my posterity. Because I enjoy it. So, all right. All right, Nubtuck. What you got? Hello. Did you know there are animals that can blend in with the snow? Mama told me to wear these glasses to protect my eyes when I'm outside. But I do it because it can help me spot the snowy friends better. Do you want to try? I would like snow glare sunglasses. Want to fly kites later? I'm looking for snowy friends. We can fly kites later. So these are these are the, the glasses I'm wearing. And wearing snow glare sunglasses. Now, supposedly, White Whisker. Let's play music outside. Oh, battle pets. Well, it just so happens I've been doing some battle pet hunting lately. I've got my capture crew ready to go. I'm getting the ones in the, um, the Emble Dream. But where? Oh, suddenly these weren't here before. White Whisker. Oh, there's a whole bunch. Okay, let's go get them. <laughs> Oh, it's one of those guys. Okay, good, and he's a green. I'll accept the green. I mean, I would have done any of them just to not spend too much time doing this. So, capture squad. Terrible turnip is from Miss Pandaria. I believe you get it from your farm um, in half health. Very useful. This attack here, weakening blow, can get them down to there. They only have one hit point thus making them easier, easier to capture. 
So first I try to hit the ball with sunlight. Because it hits the, the ones in the back. Which also counted his wintry day buff. Um, then to boot, sorry. It is a day in New York City. Uh, then to try to get some health back, I use a leap seed. It's faster than me, so I may go down. That's what I'd like. But hopefully he doesn't have a self heal. And then I can hit him a couple of times with this. You want to wait till the leech seed wears off before you hit him again, though. There we go. Well, it's hopefully I can capture him multiple quickly. Nope. Dang! <laughs> he didn't get me on the dive. Okay, cool. But we still have to take out the rest. But I do have my pet. He's I don't even know if I've gotten all the uh the pets. I don't think so. I never got all the pets for oh right, I can't kill him beyond because I'm only hitting him with one hit point. So let's switch to a pet that can do that. Snips is actually, I believe, an emperor crab. And I like to use Snips as the next backup because he's got a heal. But also this attack, Surge goes first always, regardless of speed. Also has uh, a whirlpool. I mean, it has other attacks too, but these are the three I have lined up for, for this express purpose. Surge on any pet will go first. I think if you're really curious about pet tactics. Alright, we're gonna hit another heal here. Usually really dive hits for a bit. No self-heal though, so this is an easy one. So White Whisker at leveling queue and favorite it. I favorite all my pets. Um, the reason I favorite them is not so much because I rotate them out based on favorites. It's so when I get duplicates, I can tell right away because <laughs> I know they're not favorite if, if I haven't had a chance to level them. So that's it for that. I don't think I could talk to him. Whoa, what are you? Snow glare sunglasses. Next time, bring fish, please. I think that's the only thing I can get from him. Right, let me check something. Land Safari, like barely a shadow land safari. Emerald Dream Safari, I only have two left, which is uh Hail, Summer Tooth, and Floof Talon. Um, I'm, I'm. I guess I could go try to find them now. The the pet hunting folks on Wildhead are really great in terms of like I found one here, I found one here, I found one here. Go here. I am currently. Uh, Is that a pet? <gasps> and I don't care if if it's a gray pet, because I could just upgrade it later. It's right over here. Areas obstructed. Okay, you need to die. Because you're in my way. You're cute, but you need to die. I'm sorry. There we go. It's a gray. But you know what? At this point, 
I'll just upgrade it later. I've got enough. They're too cute, though. The box. Look at it. If I can catch it, just yep, got it. Let's, let's switch tactics. Weed. No, just did that. I'm not gonna die. Oh, I will get this pet. So yeah, the other things I'm doing is I'm trying to level up my uh, unholy de DK. Um, I'm what I'm trying to do is actually get all my night elf characters through a mutrasil. My demon hunter is. Uh, We'll drop one of these. Um, my demon hunter is uh, level 70. Not geared, but he's he's decent enough. I think he might be able to. I don't know. I'll have to see. Um, my death knight, however, is 67, 68 right now. She's close. She's not geared. Uh, but. Oh. It's funny. You left them at one hit point. It's almost annoying in this case. That should do it. Alright. Floof Talon. You have a Floof Talon. Look at it. That's too cute. So I'm going to add to leveling clue, and I'm going to set as favorite. Heal everybody up. So now we have one more. We have Pale Slumbertooth to find. Let's see if I can get Pale Slumbertooth. That is Pale Slumbertooth. That's not regular Slumbertooth. That's Pale Slumbertooth. That's what we need. It's a gray. It does not matter. <laughs> You're getting it. I can't even see it. It's hidden in the bushes. Um, yeah. Now we're gonna get it. I wanna see what I'm hitting. It's achievement time. We're gonna get it. What did he even do to me? What attack was that? Some mud attack. Oh, mudslide. You hit me with mudslide. What is that about? Okay. Well, get it. It didn't land. Ooh, you're 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 difficult. You don't kill me. Ha ha! Gotcha. All right. Probably gonna die though right now. Nope. Good. I want to change the weather. Now I'm here. Which is fine. I'm gonna go right to Snips. I do. I don't name all my pets, but I will name. I will generally name, not always, but I will generally name ones that I use in pet battles. Off. Terrible Turnip just has a great name to begin with. Emperor Crab wasn't good enough for me, so it changed that. Um, Emerald Coda Drake is so I can remember which the hell it is. There's somebody named Emerald. Okay, so we are going to get... We've got one more. I'm going to drop one of these. You can't, can't even see what I'm battling. There we go. These are close now. Close. I'm just healing myself because he's... 
these skunk ones have anything that let you miss that will have attacks missed so I want to make sure that like I'm not worried that I'm gonna lose if, if for some reason snips dives during this oh here we go yes yes we got it awesome we got it all right 1 29 p.m so i'm now gonna go back to valdraken and buy some better stones for them i thought i'd have to come back and do this i'm kind of glad i've got it done I should <sighs> heal my pets up. What's a pail? Oh, let me slumber tooth. So my pale slumber tooth set favorite. That's a leveling cue, and I'm gonna summon it. So this way I can go right in here. Well then. And by Let us proceed. A marked flawless bastard. And I'll sell her some shit too. You will do well. I know it. And now it's a rare. See? There are people that put a lot more effort into, like, looking for specific stats. I don't. I don't play against other players. There, There's a weekly to do that. I think, I think actually it may have even been last week. Um, and I'm like, no. Because these people, they play too hard. They battle pet too hard. These are, these are freaking, like, Pokemon aficionados. I can't compete with Pokemon aficionados.